money get off my ass and get to the cash and get in my bag boy what's up bam world it's bam if you're new hi welcome to my channel and if you're not welcome back and i'm just gonna jump straight into this video i'm not gonna be talking during the whole video because i'm kind of sick so these are the three colors that i'm gonna be using to achieve this like kind of maroon red wine color so i'm gonna be mixing these three colors together inside the water and then i'm gonna mix it up and start dipping my hair so i'm gonna come back So now I'm finna dip my hair inside the color mixture and I'm gonna drown my wig inside the hair dye, letting all that color absorb onto the wig. And I'm basically just gonna do this until I'm satisfied with how the color looks on my wig. So I'm basically gonna use up all three bottles of the color until like I'm satisfied with the color. So y'all can just watch me do this part cause it's really self explanatory. It's nothing to really explain. So I'm gonna come back once I have something else to explain to you guys. So y'all I'm back and I'm adding this mahogany brown color inside the mixture of the three colors that I showed y'all before and I'm basically just doing this because I want to make the wig a little bit darker because I didn't want it too 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 red so I'm just adding like probably like half of the bottle of this brown dye to make the wig a little bit darker. So I'm basically gonna continue to add the mahogany brown into the red mixtures and I'm gonna mix it up and keep dipping my wig until I get the right consistency, the right like shade of maroon red that I want. So I'm just gonna continue to do that and then I'm gonna come back once I'm done dipping my hair.
so now that I'm done dipping my wig, I'm just going to shampoo the wig twice just to make sure I get all that excess hair dye off the wig. And then I'm going to condition the hair once and leave it on for 10 minutes and then rinse it out and then I'm going to come back after that. Y'all see all that red hair dye that's coming off the wig? That's why I'm shampooing my hair twice, just to get most of that hair dye off. So that's basically what I'm doing. So y'all see I got most of the hair dye off of the wig once I like wring it out like that like just a little bit of hair dye is coming off it's not as much as it was before so that's why you want to shampoo twice and condition once and make sure when you condition you rinse your wig out with cold water. So after I'm done dipping my hair this is how the color came out. And it came out like a dark maroon, red, white type of color, the color that I was going for. So now I'm taking my argan oil and I'm going to spray that all over my hair. And I'm going to brush that in and then I'm going to let my hair air dry for 24 hours. Y'all know I don't like blow drying my hair because that's enough heat already because I already be styling my hair. So I don't want to put all that heat on my hair. So I let it air dry for 24 hours and then I come back and style it but y'all can basically just watch me do this whole process it's going to be real quick and then i'm going to show y'all the end result at the end so make sure y'all stay tuned for that and if you like this video be sure to give it a thumbs up comment and subscribe to my channel and i'll see you guys in my next video it's really not that bad it just needs a little <laughs> shaping to the salon <laughs>